College ministry is a launching pad. And that's an exciting thing to be a part of as we see our graduates go off and serve the Lord faithfully in whatever field God leads them into. But that also means that from time to time our team transitions and this year has been one of marked transition as last spring and throughout the summer we have said goodbye to many faithful servants, friends that we have had the opportunity to live and work and minister side by side. Back in the spring we celebrated the retirement of Dr. Jim Harrison and he has been a colleague of ours for many many years, Dr. Handyside in the School of Education, Mr. Kowinski teaching so faithfully in the English and Humanities Department, Mrs. Lawson in the Academy for decades of faithful service in Christian education. Just a remarkable impact not only in the lives of all of our students in general but even in the lives of my sons who came through the Academy and we're so thankful for her faithful service. Clayton Morrison, athletics department, the coach of the women's team, multiple national championships, and all we've been able to celebrate in the achievements of his life and career. Even folks out of the business office like Chris Riffle, who God has opened doors for new ministry opportunities for him and for Scott Riley, our IT director as well. But with the goodbyes, we have the excitement of also being able to say hello and welcome aboard to many new folks. In fact, we have over 20 new people joining the team this year. Obviously, every year we say hello to a number of good graduate assistants who come to continue their studies at Maranatha and serve with us in a staff capacity around the campus. We honestly couldn't do it without them. But in addition to that, several new families that are joining the team that we just couldn't be more excited about. The Browns joining us from Arizona. And so, they're coming aboard here in Wisconsin at just the right time of year for their acclimation to the new climate. The Grahams joining us from Missouri and Tom is going to be the Dean of our School of Education. Sherry is working with me in the Executive Office. The Spencers, Sean and Marla. Sean is going to teach chemistry for us and coach men's volleyball. His wife Marla is going to teach in the Academy filling big shoes there with Mrs. Lawson's tenure and legacy in the English program of the Academy. Elaine Berry is going to teach English for us uh, starting this year. Isabella Peel is going to take over the big responsibility of our campus retail outlets in the coffee shop, in the bookstore, in the post office, and just keep all of those plates in the air. And we look forward to serving side by side with these incredible new folks. You know, serving alongside with your friends in ministry is an incredible joy. And I guess what I would say to you is that we still have open positions to consider. And perhaps it might be that God would lay it upon your heart to join the team, to embrace your passion, and to leave a legacy where you are discipling a next generation of leaders for the local church and the world to the praise of His glory.